the samurai always has to rise and move on, because new challenges will come. Today is victory over yourself of yesterday. Tomorrow is your victory over lesser men. Honor may not win power, but it wins respect, and respect earns power. A warrior is worthless unless he rises above others and stands strong in the midst of a storm. Everyone feels fear. What a samurai or warrior is, is what you do when you feel fear. It is good to face challenges in your youth. He who has never suffered will not sufficiently temper his character. The art of peace does not rely on weapons or brute force to succeed. Instead, we put ourselves in tune with the universe, maintain peace in our own realms, nurture life, and prevent death and destruction. The true meaning of the term Samurai is one who serves and adheres to the power of love. I know nothing about surpassing others. I only know how to outdo myself. As a samurai, I must strengthen my character. As a human being, I must perfect my spirit. Get beyond love and grief. Exist for the good of man. The undisturbed mind is like the calm body water reflecting the brilliance of the moon. Empty the mind and you will realize the undisturbed mind. It is a wretched thing that the young men of today are so contriving and so proud of their material possessions. Men with contriving hearts are lacking duty. Lacking in duty, they will have no self-respect. It is the very mind itself that leads the mind astray. Of the mind, do not be mindless. This is the substance of the way of the samurai. If by setting one's heart right every morning and evening, one is able to live as though the body were already dead, he gains freedom in the way. His whole life will be without blame, and he will succeed in his calling. I am not a fighter, but in my mind I'm fighting every day. What's new? What am I doing? I'm fighting myself. My soul is samurai. My roots are not samurai, but my soul is. The samurai is the first to suffer anxiety for human society, and he is the last to seek personal pleasure. The discipline of strength instills resistance without complaint, and also teaches courtesy. It demands that we not ruin the pleasure or serenity of others through the expression of our own sadness or pain. When you give advice, 
you should first discern whether or not the other person is willing to accept it. If you embark on an uncharted path, infinite secrets will appear at the end. Just as a snake sheds its skin, we must shed our past over and over again. What you are is what you have been. What you will be is what you do now. Even as a solid rock is unshaken by the wind, so were the wise unshaken by praise or blame. Thousands of candles can be lit from a single candle, and the life of the candle will not be shortened. Happiness never decreases by being shared. We are shaped by our thoughts, we become what we think. When the mind is pure, joy follows like a shadow that never leaves. Every morning we are born again. What we do today is what matters most. Do not look for sanctuary in anyone except yourself. If you propose to speak, always ask yourself, is it true, is it necessary, is it kind? No one saves us but ourselves. No one can and no one may. We ourselves must walk the path. The secret of health for both mind and body is not to mourn for the past, nor worry about the future, but to live the present moment wisely and earnestly. Drop by drop is the water pot filled. Likewise the wise man gathering it little by little fills himself with good. There is nothing so disobedient as an undisciplined mind, and there is nothing so obedient as a disciplined mind. If you find no one to support you on your spiritual path, walk alone. Peace comes from within, do not seek it without. Have compassion for all beings, rich and poor alike, each has their suffering. Some suffer too much, others too little. If your compassion does not include yourself, it is incomplete. Hatred does not cease by hatred, but only by love. This is the eternal rule. Nothing can harm you as much as your own thoughts unguarded. In the sky, there is no distinction of east and west. People create distinctions out of their own minds, and then believe them to be true. If we fail to look after others when they need help, who will look after us? A generous heart kind speech, 
and a life of service and compassion are the things which renew humanity. An idea that is developed and put into action is more important than an idea that exists only as an idea. Endurance is one of the most difficult disciplines, but it is to the one who endures that the final victory comes. Let us rise up and be thankful, for if we didn't learn a lot, at least we learnt a little, and if we didn't learn a little, at least we didn't get sick, and if we got sick, at least we didn't die. So let us be thankful. All that we are is the result of what we have thought. It is founded on our thoughts and made up of our thoughts. If a man speaks or acts with an evil thought, suffering follows him as the wheel follows the hoof of the beast that draws the wagon. If a man speaks or acts with a good thought, happiness follows him like a shadow that never leaves. Holding on to anger is like grasping a hot coal with the intent of throwing it at someone else. You are the one who gets burned. One moment can change a day, one day can change a life, and one life can change the world. Be where you are, otherwise you will miss your life. Kindness should be the natural way of life, not the exception. It is better to travel well than to arrive. To live a pure, unselfish life, one must count nothing as one's own in the midst of abundance. Whatever a monk keeps pursuing with his thinking and pondering, that becomes the inclination of his awareness. A man is not called wise because he talks and talks again, but if he is peaceful, loving and fearless, then he is in truth called wise. You will not be punished for your anger, you will be punished by your anger. Just as the great ocean has one taste, the taste of salt, so also this teaching and discipline has one taste, the taste of liberation. The root of suffering is attachment. Your work is to discover your world, and then, with all your heart, give yourself to it. There is no fire like passion, there is no shark like hatred, there is no snare like folly, there is no torrent like greed. Do not dwell in the past, do not dream of the future, concentrate the mind on the present moment.
Happiness will never come to those who fail to appreciate what they already have.